who done it? Gemmin Collectibles, it's your boy Gemmin. I'm here with my man PJ in Manhattan, New York City at Midtown Comics, the biggest comic shop in the city. Been here for 20 years. We're gonna go up in here, take a little tour around, see what it looks like, and hopefully uh, get some exclusives. comic book wall here as you can see got a good crowd going on it's about 11 a.m. so uh, everyone's getting their new weekly polls man Take a look. So I like a shop that has a lot of variety, you know what I'm saying? Because I collect, you know, a variety of things, so good stuff, man. Who done it?
he works here at Midtown Comics. What's going on, bro? What's going on, man? I was talking to you a little bit earlier. You mentioned that uh, Midtown just celebrated a 20 year anniversary. Yeah, 20 years last year, 1997. 97, man. 97, what was I doing? I think I was definitely into comics. Yeah, I know. So was I. I just started reading. So, uh, how long have you been working at Midtown? 10 years. So you get to just talk to people about comics all day, every day. Comics, toys, you know, it's such a hard job. Yeah, it sounds terrible. It's such a hard life, man, <laughs> I'm telling you. Living the dream, Woo! man. You still picking up, like, weekly titles and stuff? Yeah, of course. I got to. Oh, man, uh, from Marvel and DC, I'm reading Justice League, Avengers, Thor, Superman, Green yeah. Lantern. But you mentioned, yeah, you kind of got to be on top of it because people are going to ask you what's good. Exactly. So it's really for, like, work purposes. Yeah, exactly. It's research. It's research. What do, yeah. you, what do you think are some of the best titles right now? What the Venom stuff? Uh, Venom's pretty solid. Yeah. Uh, I like, I like, I like. Uh, I've been liking Thor for a long time. I like Avengers, man. That he's telling Jason Aaron some big stories. Jason Aaron's doing a lot. He is, he is hitting That's my man. Apart. He is one of the best out there. Yeah, for in sure. In terms of image, man, there's a lot of books that they do that are good. I mean, yeah, well, I know Oblivion song is, is hot right now. Good. Uh, I like, uh, I like Rain. Mm, which it, it doesn't come out. It's basically like, what if a fantasy world invaded our world and mm. it's set in Chicago and you've got like people start trying to survive in Chicago with no power and they got, you know, like mercenaries everywhere and then you got these orcs and dragons flying around. It's crazy. It's a crazy Sounds mix. Dope. It's called Rain? Yeah. From uh, Image? Yeah. No, yeah. Is it? It's, no, it's Realm. Not realm. realm. It's okay. Realm. So, you know what I noticed though? So, I, first of all, I was at the con. And I seen your guys' booth. Right. You guys had Joe Jusco, which is like my favorite artist of all time. He's great. And I love the um, Wolverine cover he did for you guys. That's like one of the only variant covers that I purchased. Yeah, it was nice. At all recently. I and got stashed. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, I got so it. So I had the trade dress, and I got a couple of uh, virgins down there at the con. Right. I didn't get him to sign it. I'm not really a big signature guy. Sure, I hear you. But what's um, you guys have a little bit of everything. Right. The only thing I'm not seeing is like the CGC books. Yeah. That's because we we have a partnership with CGC, but we just started doing that maybe a month or two ago. Oh, really? We actually, if you go downstairs, we actually started getting them in. They're behind the counter. Oh, so I just didn't see them. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. We just, but it's only it's still new. It's only been like a month or two that we started doing it, and we we do CGC for them. Like if you, if you bring your books in, you yeah, want yeah. graded, we're great. We'll send. We don't grade them. We send it over yeah, to yeah. them to get graded. Cool, man. So we just started doing that not that long ago, actually, pretty recent. So. It's a dope service, man. Yeah. I'm sure you guys have like a pull list and everything. And yeah, of course. Yeah. Pull list. You, you go online, you can reserve, you know, books for the week before. You, yeah. you don't have to do a subscription. So it's online. That's dope. Now, a lot of yeah. shops, you just have to write your name on a piece of paper. Yeah, no, no. We, we <laughs> got. I mean, we got so many customers coming in. Yeah, you got to take care of them. You got to take care of them. It's got to be just, you know? the most busy shop ever. I mean, you're in Manhattan here. Yeah, I mean, hands down. Listen. You're, we're in Times Square between all the regulars, all the tourists coming in from out of town. Now it's, we got the con people. Yeah, that's crazy. Nice. So you have three locations here. Three locations in the city, yep. And this is the main one? This is the main one. This is the first one. I love it. It's a great shop, man. I'm envious that you work here. Appreciate it, yeah. But uh, I guess we won't take every time because you're on the clock. You got it. Thanks, brother. city in the background a lot of smaller scale statues in these windows but a very good look
who done it? Man, that was a dope shot, man. I love how you walk up in there and you, you immediately go up the stairs. It feels like you're going to like some exclusive club or something. Super clean shop. They got everything from comics to shirts to statues, omnibus. They had a good omnibus selection there. Uh, so definitely a dope spot. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Drop me a comment in the bottom. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more local comic shop spotlights. We go out of town a lot, so that's our thing. We want to try to check you know, some local flavor when we're out of town. So y'all stay minty. Peace.